everybody, welcome to Miss Tori's Read and Learn. We will have a special read aloud about science. Our book is called Meet Bacteria by Rebecca Belosky. In our book, we'll learn what bacteria is and what they do. Let's dig deep into their tiny world. There's a world so tiny. You can't see it with just your eyes. Wow, if it's so small, how do you think we can see into such a tiny place? We will need to use a microscope to make it big enough to see. A microscope is a tool used to see very tiny things. It is used by people such as scientists, doctors, or engineers. Many things live in this tiny world. Some of them are bacteria. It's true. And if you'd like to meet them, they'd like to meet you too. Bacteria are everywhere, in dirt, in air. Although they can't be seen, bacteria can be found on walls and doors, on chairs and floors, in cracks and in between. Bacteria can be found in many places. Let's explore some of their homes. I like frozen places. I live in snow and ice. I prefer a hotter home. For me, the weather's nice. Arrgh, I live in the water too. My place is the sea. Me, I hate that salty taste. The pond's the place to be. If they find something that's yummy, that they'll like to eat for lunch, they'll multiply so quickly. What does multiply mean? It means the number of bacteria will grow. First, there's only one. Then there's a bunch. No pushing, please. You're on my foot. Some of them are naughty. To make us sick is their aim. When you get a belly ache, sometimes they're the ones to blame. So, after the toilet, and before your food, I hope, you don't forget to wash your hands with water and with soap. After this video, there are some links in the description for some songs about washing your hands. Most of them don't bother us. They are our little neighbors. Some of them can help us. They give some foods their flavor. Bacteria make yogurt and stinky cheese, too. Do you like stinky cheese? I sure do. Some help us by eating trash. That's a yucky job to do. Now we've met bacteria and we've learned something new. Whether nice or scarier, they're part of our world, too. The end. Bacteria come in many different shapes. There are circles, rods, spirals, bunches, and chains. Thank you for watching this video about bacteria and their microscopic world. If you liked this video, please consider liking it and subscribing for more videos about math, science, and reading. See you next time. Goodbye, friends.